Dati, a chance to set the ball. She's gonna run a brilliant offense. No, napakaswabe magset itong ano nung setter, no? And Petron is passing the ball, you know, giving Erika Dati multiple chances to set the ball. And for more on this game, we have Mela Tuna. James and Tex, like I mentioned earlier, medyo nag-tone down nga daw ang photo ng Lady Tornadoes in terms of their training para ma-relax ang muscles ng mga players at matanggal ang pressure sa kanila. At so far, medyo maganda naman daw epekto nito sa kanilang ensayo. Matapos silang tulunin ang powerhouse na Army Lady Troopers last Tuesday sa isang tune-up game in five sets. Pero medyo mukhang baliktad ang epekto dito sa larong ito dahil ang laki ng hinahabol ng ating Lady Tornadoes sa duration ng first set. At medyo mas stiff at limited ang galaw nila. Samantalang isa pang mahigpit na bilhin ni Coach Bilet sa kanyang players involving their services ay targeting kahit sino, kahit sino sa Petron maliban lamang kay Jen Reyes. This way, maaari nila limitahan ang mga magagandang plays ng Blaze Spikers. Back to you, James and Tex. Uh, Mela, before I let you go, uh, you, I just want to ask, you've seen itong Photon compete sa kanilang mga nakaraang laro. Ano yung pinagkaiba ng body language nila noon at ngayon dito sa ating partners? Actually, James, kanina narinig ko sa huddle nila na kung tutuos na wala daw sa kanila yung pressure dahil uh, itong Petron Day Spikers ang defending champion. Kaya ina-expect ng lahat na mas fluid yung galaw nila ngayon. Pero kaninang first set, medyo mas stiff, medyo mas hindi sila nag-uusap. Siguro yun yung nag-cause sa kanila ng first set, ng pagkatalo ng first set, at yung mga errors nila talaga nag-pile up even their services, no? Back to you. Mela Tunay, of course, a competitor herself, knows what's going on. Maraming salamat, Mela. Please keep us posted. That's Photon with the first point on the board, and the second, it looks like the tornadoes are woken up. Well, it's about time that they pass the ball in transition, and pass a receive it na magandang first ball. Ayun, they ran a combination play. Now, you see, Jaja run the fake, and Stalser now got isolated. Ayun, high percentage ang offense mo niyan. Here's Hubie, eh? Trying to catch a blocker. Araneta goes to Lindsay. Erika will set up Hupia Inc. again. Brazilian connection. Couldn't connect that time. Papalik muna ni Lindsay Stalser. Maranyo asking for it. Oh, it's a combination for Hupia Inc. And that one is good, says the first referee. Coach Villette uh, with the video challenge signal. So if this one is accepted, it will be the first challenge of our game. Number three. What Coach Villette? Tapos sumay na siya ng check ball. Uy, meron. Pinky. Pinky. Tiritin na natin kung uh, dumaplis any part of the body. Oh, but that one is unsuccessful. So not enough according to our video challenge. Again, if there is an unsuccessful challenge, there will be one challenge left for this set para kay Coach Villette. Correct. So it is 2-1, advantage still with Photon, but a chance for Petron to equalize with this service from Abby Maranyo. Combination play for Stalzer! Okay, that's the nice thing, because they nila si Jaja, obviously. And as you can see, Jaja Santiago drawing the defenders, setting up Stalzer for the Stone Cold Stunner. <laughs> The howitzer showing why she's got an 88 Mike Mike in her arm. Says Molina, hahatao. Katie Messing this time. Trying to go long, and she gets it to go. Yeah, Katie Messing going clear over everybody there, using all of her 6 foot 3. And even the crowd getting into it, the fans of Photon Tornadoes trying to cheer on their team. As they're up by 3, Dita is set number 2. Time Photon targets Dindin Santiago Manaba. And that one cannot go over. Good effort though, Malasa Photon. Coach Willett probably telling Jaja, Matars ka na lang. Two point ball game. Two serving four with Hupia Inc. on deck. Hupia Inc. serving four. Very 
NYC fans of the Photon Tornadoes always in attendance from day one ng kanilang laban. Wala pa dun sa Lotus Sports Arena nung binyan. Nag-impressive yung mga yan. As Lindsay Stauser with six attack points already. Serves it up. Back set. Manabak. Deny! Boy, sabi ni Jaja. Ako naman ang magtitake over mode. Take a look at the message by the Photon Tornadoes. Not under my group. You're grounded. Rachel Dak is over the defense. There is the Jaja. Coverage by Abby. Manabat again. But Photon defending the floor better. Stauser off the ball. Excellent transition dito sa kapunan ng Photon. As long as they are transitioning, pas na to be sa sila, they have a chance. Tingnan mo naman ang mga arpas nila. Lindsay Stauser, Jaja Santiago, Katie Messing. That's a sky-high replay. Stauser catches a blocker. She serves it up. And scores from the service line. And this is exactly what Photo needed to get their uh, juices flowing. No? They turned it around. They were down 8-2 to two in the first set. Sila naman lang ngayon sa technical timeout. Okay, yan para din sa Petron at para sa Photon, meron sila mga armas tulad ni Lindsay Stauser at ni Hupia Eng. Yeah, well, Lindsay Stauser on the right side, no, or the opposite hitter. Grabe itong babae ko. He can attack from everywhere. And then you have Hupia Eng, who also attacks either from the left or the right. And when she gets going, she puts damage in such in your defense. Nakakawalang gana yung defensa. Then she just finds a way to get through. And both players making impact. In any way they can, and to see Lindsay Stauser, 7 of the 15 points of 5th set, contra sa Phillips Gold. Take over mode para sa kanya, si Rupi Ink the man, game long brilliance against Sigma. Katie Messick, rejected. Williams and Stauser almost bumping into each other. Good defense para sa Photon, Manabat! Trying to go long, but out of bounds, and Photon in a frenzy. That's how it is, really. Sayang yun, but boy, Photon stayed in that point. Lindsay Stauser, you gotta give her a, a little medal for the effort there. Kayla, Kayla Williams and uh, Lindsay Stauser just throwing caution to the wind. Talaga, buis buhay. But that's the effort you want. In the technical timeout, we're listening to Coach Villette. That's the thing, when your defense is performing, your offense now is performing, you can talk tactics. You don't have to burn a timeout for anything like, oh, receive naman tayo, I have to stop the momentum now. Sulit yung usap nyo because it's now tactics. Because you're doing your job. I'm sure the handle of Petron with George Pasqua also was uh, talking tactics. So there is a challenge on the part of uh, Coach George Pasqua. I will, I will run my system until you try, you beat me. That touch is... Challenge para kay Coach George. The point was not successful. That one not successful. The point will stay with the Photon Tornadoes. The both coaches in Kanila Una Challenge are both unsuccessful. Judge Santiago doing the little uh, walk like an Egyptian dance there to her ate. <laughs> Game on, remember? Remember in the teaser. Mamayanang ate ate. Oh, now about running attack. That's not how I dance, little sister. This is how I do it, says Dindin Manabat. Yeah, this is the, in the old Filipino country, this was the exact same play that won them that championship that down the line running attack. And I haven't said it in a while, Taksura, when you have the hammer. You put it down. Let's hear from Mitchell Carmen. We're sticking with the system. It has worked before and it is still working now. Maaring pwede silang mabasa nga ng kanyang kalaban pero mataas pa rin ang tiwala ni Coach George sa kanyang players. With their maturity and experience, he knows that they will take the initiative and recreate themselves. Siguro ang pinaka-adjustments na lang na ginawa nga ni Coach George para sa Petron ay nakita na natin yung positioning ni Rupia Ng kung saan nagde-defend yung position niya sa position ni Lindsay Stauser. Ngayon, outside hitter siya where she is expected to be more of a defensive player for this game to stop stop. So the locals are expected to put more of the numbers for the Blaze Spikers today. Pero ito nga, na kanilang atin na si Rachel Dacus, we're not up for the individual awards here. It's all for one and one for all. Balik sa inyo. Speaking of locals, Jaja Santiago taking the point back with authority. Yeah, and then that's what happens when you 
put that ball six inches higher. Dinner will help. Papaluhin niya yung ball and she'll go clear over. Erika Adati again testing the discipline of the defense of Photon and proving na nanonood kayo. You're just expecting me to set all night. It's not gonna happen. That's her third successful uh, over on two. One of her favorites, uh, the attacke de sorpresa in her own words. Another top serve para sa Photon Blaze of Photon. Thanks to Ivy Perez and hey, a little tit for tat here. Santiago Sisters going at it and the setters testing each other. And it makes for great volleyball. Photon, 11 serving five. Dito sa ating second set. Katie Messick to serve. Abby Marano, block. They go to the other side, to Dakis. Galga Pestalzer, Perez, Guaraneta. Rally continues. Marano, soft hit. Good defense by Ivy. They send it to Lindsay. Through the block! So nice to have an outlet hitter in the quality of uh, Lindsay Stalzer. Napaka steady niya talaga. Front row, back row, doesn't matter. He is a forma. But uh, hitting from the back row, the technique there is you just have to hit a little longer. The, the ball has to travel. Before, clear the net. Bago siya mag dip. Good dig by Bia General. Stalzer again, a back attack. Good defense by Petron. Dakis again, another dig by General. Williams, dug up. Dakis swings and finishes. Medyo na paagay yung block na yan eh. They should have delayed, no? Miss ball situation. Medyo na paagay yung talo nila. Pababa na si Ivy Perez nung pinalo ni Dakis. Grace Van Dakis, three attack points dito sa ating laro. On deck to serve. Her team down by six. Almost got help from the net. Araneta. Kupia Inc. A difficult angle sends it out of bounds. But look at the vision of Kupia Inc. No? A little uh, veteran savvy there. No? Kita niya. Nag overcommit si Kayla Williams. And Bea Hineral was in the shadow of the block. Kita niya bakante dun. She just didn't execute well. But good vision there from Kupia Inc. Adjustment on Siguro, Pasun na yung tira na yun. And look at that, Bolton scoring with the service line. Yeah, everybody expecting expecting to hit, no? They didn't realize that, uy, kailangan pala kunin yung bola muna. Erika Adachi, I don't know if you called for help or not, but dapat help should have come. Her service ace, para kay Ivy Perez. Williams, let it get the regalo. Back set, Stauser puts it down. Yeah, Erika Adachi, really incensed by her teammates. Talaga, sabi niya, pass the ball. <laughs> Hold on. Now on a fair, a big 15 to 6. Still, Kaitin Teatano subs in. Okay, Rachel Andakis for sub. Okay, Coach George Pasqua. Of the, the baby faced assassin there now in uh, Phil Cayetano. She looks so frail and dainty and whatnot, but boy, she can put the ball away. In her own right, no? Yeah, maybe we get on a photon. Kapa pasa plantin our gets a service. Uh, this thing's the one that hindi pa mai hit. And photon with the lead, 16 to 6. The photon tornadoes showcasing excellent execution. Lamang sila 16 to 6, kanila pinakamalaking kalamangan dito sa ating laro, sa ating second set. Yeah, it's uh, parang nag, ano, I'll take the set off, sabi ng Petron. It's parang tail of two sets. Well, good defense at the back. Stalls are from the right. Adachi goes back to Hupia Inc. Messing defending the floor. So, Padon! Nahataw ang Petron, Eric Adachi. Score. Stop the bleeding, Bea General, all the way up past the attack line. Nobody minding the chickens in the coop in the back row. Nakita mga kanina, text ito si Erika Dachi, in your own words, in sense. Her teammates, after that string of errors, Saraneta, also attack, Adachi was there to dig it up. 
speed. Okay, it will score. Oh, the general oh, upset with herself as she should be. Got caught watching there and, and tagal ng reaction time niya. Uh, maybe expecting Hupi Ink to hammer it home. Just uh, sent them a soft touch. Perez chasing after it. Stalls from the left. Hupi Ink with back to back hits. But it's a bit more. Okay, let's see if uh, Erika Dachi can wheel her team. Not to start uh, playing defense and passing the ball, giving her those set opportunities. Sayang, she's running a really good offense. The setup, the wind up, but no finish. No surprise there. Stauser comes out of nowhere looking for an angle. Good defense by Reyes. But Stauser on the second try. Stauser heads up to the net play, no? Kita niya, baka ito itong zone four. But the game thing Reyes was there. Yun, naging regalo. Kita niya, zone one was empty. She went high hands, aiming for zone one. At kita may respect na binibigyan ng Petron kay Stauser. As Araneta serves on the race. Nakasabay sa kanya nung umatake siya. At ngayon, pati yung kanyang mga kakampay. Tulad ni Angel Araneta, joining the scoring frame. She has two attacks and a service ace to her name. Yeah, she, if she gets into the uh, eight, eight point range, you know, she should have done her job. Her real job there is to really slow down the offense of Petron. Abby Marano uh, to the score. Now both on to take this 10 point lead from George Pasqua and cut out the timeout. Refused to lose attitude of uh, Erika Adachi. Oh, Stauser. Good little, uh, little boo boo there. Sa area na siya, aso. Para maling calculation niya do sa kanya pagguelo at pagtalon. Kaya puntos para sa Petron, trailing by nine. Na una yung kanyang lundag sa talon. Look at this play for Stauser. Reyes keeps it alive. Hupia eight, hammers it home. My question is why is Bea General trying to kick the ball up? Dapat ano, kamay. Hindi naman ganun kalakas yung bola. I went into coach mode there. 11 serving 19. Lessing gives it back. Manaba to the score. Perez to Jaja. And little sister will elevate the set See when that ball is in her wheelhouse, mas nagagawa niya ng paraan eh. Because you maximize her, you make her stretch. Tignan mo. She's up. She hangs. Goes deep, deep zone five. It's just smart hitting from Jaja Santiago. Good set. Or better set here from uh, Ivy Perez. Sas Molina, back or too strong. Medyo nahuli yung kanyang wrist snap doon, no? kaya parang nagbukang service yung bola. No? I think there will be a challenge from Coach George Pasqua. So, Unsuccessful na siya kanina. Yes, susubok siya ulit. I think he doesn't want to burn a timeout personally. The challenge is for a block touch. This challenge should have been denied. And we will look at Paris and touch. Trying to zoom in. Ooh, close call. 
Frank Entzi, the thumb. So by the thumb, the right hand, the thumb, major may zoom out. Ah, wala, wala. The ball's by already. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's successful. So I guess it meant the right thumb. Even for just a little part of it, so merong uh, touch. Uh, puntos para sa Petron Blades. So it's really nice to see George Pan go down. And away with the momentum killer and... Nakapuntos pa siya. Smart challenge there from George Pasqua. This team still trailing by eight. 12 serving 20 in set number two. They set up a play for Jaja. Phil flies. Jaja again, different shot. Molina swings. Messing swings. But this rally continues. Crowd getting antsy. And finally, Petron will score. And Coach Villette pointing out, hey, you know, the simply simply na mga play na ginagawa na kalaban. So, Kay Glenn Cayetano will be sub. Para kay, I mean, Rachel Dak is subbing in for Phil Kaynlet Cayetano. So, Coach George Pasca going tall in that front line. Good rotation with Manabat, Olina, and Dak. Oh, when you look at uh, Phil Cayetano would be matched up against Lindsay Stalzer. May pabola dito. Back set to Manabat. And she will score off the block. Okay, Petron showing their poise now, no? That they're starting to run a good offense now, starting to pass the ball a little better. Photon can't rest on this lead, especially with a team like Petron. Kailangan habang nakabawon yung kalaban, baon yung lalo. 11 points for Hu Piang so far. Stalzer winds it up. Dug up by Adachi. The tip. The push. No catching of the line. And point again to Petron looking to go on a run. And look at the uh, Hupia Inc. No? Following the rule of volleyball, no? you don't uh, watch the ball go out. Ihatid mo palabas. Timeout whistle. That's us in it. Out to question the defense and uh, how they rotate with each other, interact with each other. Lindsay Stalls are very vocal in that uh, in the huddle now, showing some leadership. Katie Messing, maybe telling her to loosen up a bit. Here's Messing with that slow, low swing. Gets the job done. Yeah, went clear over to Molina there. Making use of all six foot three. Her body and her reach. That was at Lindsay Stalzer for the service line. Yeah, if you're Petron, baka masaya ka. Ay, salamat. Lindsay Stalzer's in the back row. Pero, grabe naman siya mag back row attack. Ay, pabola. Jaja Santiago. Trying to score. No. Here's Dakis. Coverage by Bia General. Combination play for Katie Messing. Dug up by Abby. Dakis winds it up. Rejected, defended, and denied. Nice form block there by Ivy Perez. Not uh, allowing Rachel and Dakis to tool her outside. You know what? Turn her back into the court. Back from where you came. Okay, 
George Pasqua has seen the tendency that Photon is planting on the blocking side, no? Medyo maabang na sila, so they want to change up a play, run a play in the middle. Gonna test uh, the resolve of the blocking of Photon. Tignan natin kung uh, makareceive itong Petron and run that play. Photon within three points of taking the second set. Bowser covers her blockers. Santiago denied. Manaba denied. And a three ball. Oy, nako, hindi na abutan, hindi kinuha. Okay, that, uh, that, that ball was totally be general. No, you don't want your middle attacker in Jaja uh, Santiago receiving that. Diba kasi overball na eh. Ah, be general. Uh, I don't know, maybe a little, feeling a little uh, kaba. Combination for Messing. Tricky shot. Oh, kick save. Messing's of that not over. Yeah, missed time there by Katie Messing. And Doc is impressed by that kick save from Erica Dachi. Take a look at it once again. So nice. You got to see it twice. Keep the ball up with every part of your body. Well, she is Brazilian, so it probably comes a second nature to her. <laughs> Excellent point. Molina serves. Molina na makumuha ng second ball. And Coach Villet is frustrated. You can, uh, I have to put that one on Ivy Perez, no? Second ball. You gotta own it. You can't let Petron, they're creeping back. Papalapit ng papalapit. Gustong Dumikit, 18 to 22. And there is a violation on the part of the Photon Tornadoes. I think a rotation error? Yeah, uh, they, uh, they switched before the serve was contacted, so technically that's out of position. What was once a 10-point lead, now down to just three. Yeah, this is the way uh, Photon should have played in that uh, first set, no? Grinding it out, creeping ever so closer, no? But uh, Photon just uh, kind of crumbling here. They need to get some points together and close this set out. They want to go to Katie Messing, who is blocked by Erika Adachi. And gets a celebratory hug from Abby Marano. And a timeout whistle for Photon. the focus of her players now hey you gotta concentrate on the task at hand now we gotta close this set out then Lindsay Stauser doing a little uh, coaching of her own you see the block by Erica Adachi sending that ball from whence you came well for block there from Erica Adachi Abby Marano that's what you get when you play well and Abby Marano carrying hug Katie Messing adjusts Yes, That's how you want to go out of a timeout. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta cash in the opportunities now. Okay. Now the pressure here is on Angelia Araneta. She needs to slow the ball down. This is an attack of photo. No? Abang give... nasa likod si Jaja Santiago. Correct. So we yeah, have Perez messing. Araneta in front. Santiago does damage from the service line. Yeah, an insurance point, no? That will uh, really relax the entire hold uh, on lineup. But you see it doubles up. This is more maybe to give Erica Dachi a little breather. 
Set point here in set number two. Jaja Sanchago taking her time. Four attack points and a service ace to her name. It's an error. Still a window open. Para sa Petron Blaze. And we've seen crazier things happen here in the Philippine Superliga. Can Petron fight to survive. Mickey Messing. The defense by Petron. That is blocked. Chase down. Araneta. And Araneta takes the second set for Fulton. They're all tied up. One set apiece as Fulton gets set number two, 25 to 21. The Tornadoes, young, hungry, and looking for victory. Set number three, when we come back, this is game one of the finals of the Philippine Superliga on Sports 5.